Mm. White lives don't matter because white lives aren't a thing. <laughs> you can be uh, proud of being Italian. You can be proud of being Scottish. You cannot be proud of being white. It's not a thing. Oh, oh he's saying literally exactly what I was saying. Yeah, of course. Flip side, black folk has to say black lives matter because we were stolen from a country that we loved and were forced to be here stripped of our heritage and our identities. All we know is our blackness. There's a difference between saying black lives matter and what exactly and if you knew like fucking three black people you would already know this reality i hadn't even seen the context but that is the truth why do people stay ask stay asking stupid questions what did i just describe to you dude does it do i sound like the type of dude that gets pussy I said I went to sleep at 3.30 because I was farming materials in an online video game, brother. Does it sound like I get pussy, dude? Let me tell you something. I wouldn't know what pussy looks like if it was standing in front of my face at this point. So no, I did not get fucking pussy last Ooh, night what i got was 10,000 20,000 mats of <laughs> trees wood Percentage couple thousand stone i went the into the pvp area and found a fucking donkey you make bad videos what's next you gonna go to vimeo donkey you're smelling kind of funky you're bad, you couldn't beat Splunky. Every time I stream, I sit down for a meal. Once I win this battle, you'll be crying, stop to steal. Donkey, you're a fucking broke boy. You'll need this scrap. I'll tell you go home, boy. Mondays, maybe for motherfucking drama. But my dick can't get enough of your mama. It's not enough to go back and forth. Time to spit bars like the force. I'm about to talk in Turkish for the next portion. So you might not understand what I'm about to say. Donkey. Geldin buraya neden geri verdin? Gelemedin ama gel beni verdin. Amerikalılar İngilizce biliyor. Anlamıyorlar dediklerimi bilmiyor. Pepeyla dedim ben burada. Gel beni usta. Zach things that he said were... But I think he's talking about how, like, there is not a real concept such as white. And the only reason why there is such a thing as, like, black people or a culmination of, like, black identity, black culture is because of, uh, because of, of groups of people from Africa being removed from their fucking cultural background. So they had to rebuild a shared history in the United States of America as a consequence of that genocide, as a consequence of slavery, and that... When you say, you know, white lives matter, white lives don't matter because white lives don't exist. It's not a real thing. You can say Puerto Rican lives matter, or you can say Italian lives matter. You can say Irish lives matter. But when you say white lives matter, that's not what he's saying, which by the way, I think is still a, a touch edgy. And I am literally, I have a doctorate in saying edgy shit that really triggers the fuck out of people. Okay. Clip ending without him actually explaining what he means. I mean, I don't agree with him, but shit, why try and make it more misleading? Literally minus two points. Most controversial comment. I just clicked on sort by controversial. And the most controversial comment is the one that's fucking uh, applying context to the situation. Wow, dude. Fucking wow, dude. dude. I'm sorry, but like, god damn. Change your password. I already did, brother, but it's not my password. They fucking cracked, okay? And I, I do have two-factor. It's not that. It's literally on the back end, dude. If someone had access to my fucking account, why would they change my fucking stream key? There's like a million different things that they could do, dummy. Like, changing my fucking uh, stream key is something that someone who does not have access to my account directly could be able to do if they're like an admin over at Twitch, like a staff or some shit. But if they had like actual fucking access to my Twitch account, full access to my Twitch account, not just like changing my stream key on the back end, then they could literally do whatever the fuck they want. They could change my name from Hasanabi to whatever the fuck they want to change it to. Eilish refused to play your princess after you falsely accused. Donkey causing more drama. 
What is he doing? I know it was you. I know you're acting AFK. You killed me. Hello? How will... Okay. Ban him. Ban him. Mods? Mods! It's too far. That's too far, dude. That is fucking way too far. He needs to be banned. Go. Drive Go. by door knock, dude? What's next? Are you going to leave a bag of poop that's on fire outside of their doorstep? Big drama. That's exactly the kind of toxic rust. Dude, this is what I mean. When I say rust toxicity, dude, rust fucking toxicity is out of control. Also, why is he playing with motion blur on? Jesus Christ, Dunky. Vigor gets taunted in the consequences of breaking character. Okay, I'm not doing that again. Like, literally. It's so fucking annoying. And then now they're going to take everything that I had and, like, I brought over there. It was so close, like... Ugh. It's so... It, it's just, like, it, it's just not worth it. It's literally not worth it. it it's not worth it. They can't loot. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Someone will take the fucking gun because it was on the ground. The best the problem. And and that was it. We were going to do trial by combat. Like, that's what I was going to suggest. But even then, it's like, it doesn't matter. Even then, it doesn't matter because we couldn't even do that. Look. <laughs> That's good. That's how you're supposed to do good role playing. Like, that's how you role playing is not about like maximizing. I I mean I don't know. I, I don't know. I'm a I'm not a great role player myself, but like, like that's a perfect example. I feel like of great content that comes out of doing like really good role play. First of all, allow yourself to be a loser. Cause like the biggest problem I think is like. We all got big ass egos, right? So, because we're all fucking narcissistic Twitch streamers. Of course, we all got big ass egos. So, everyone's always like, I need to win. I need to win. I need to win every fucking time. And it's like, and the chat probably heightens that too, because the expectation for your content creator is like, oh, you're a fucking loser. You're a loser. Why are you losing? You're my streamer. You need to win. You need to win. You need to win. You need to win. And then, like, that fucking ruins it for role play, which is why I think I don't know what the fuck happened there. I, you should have known I would not abandon you. You should have known I would not abandon you. Wait a minute. I got it. The real reason why there weren't that many cops available on that day is because they were attending the protest. Oh my God. Oh my God. The reason why they were understaffed is literally because they were attending the protest, dude. Probably took the day off to go, you know, blow off some steam. Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah. like Robin, I think I'm going to bat you. <laughs> I haven't seen graphics like this since I played Nat 2. Coming at you with the spaghetti and meatballs. I'm about to spray oh. jism up on these walls. Yo, I'll hit you with the backhanded right I slap. And okay, I'll take your fucking rings back. Sonic, nothing. That game sucks. I'm a believer mm -hmm. in fucking knuckles like mm -hmm. trucks. Uganda, I ain't even seen you. I'll see you oh, next oh time God. when I bend over Lena. No, no, no, no. Okay, that's all. Oh, can't do that. Oh, oh, no, no, no. She's no. way too Jesus, far. Jesus, that was off Jesus. the dome. I got into oh, it. Oh, that was off the head. That was off the head. I told you. Alexander Botez discovers Hikaru unfollowed her on Twitter. Did he follow my happy three months, BB. Speaking of unfollowing, Botez unfollowed me. Did he? Wait, let me look. I will laugh. Drama. Yeah, Botep unfollowed me on on Twitter. I'm trying to explain that I'm a person who wishes to live a very quiet life. I take care not to trouble myself with any enemies like winning and losing. It'd be my honor to tell you. That yes, I am a Trump supporter, by God. I mean, he did concede. But, 
but I still love him in my I heart. I was about to do that too. No! <laughs> Sorry. Why are y'all hitting me? These are. <laughs> I did not miss. They're I radical. These are radical. I got a little scared. <laughs> Y'all are radical socialists. I knew I it. Was also quite it's been so long since I've seen this photo, not Photoshop, that I was like, wait a minute. Did you Photoshop my head large on this? I literally forgot what I look like in this photo when it's not Photoshop. I didn't even know that this photo existed on the internet without Photoshop at this point. <laughs> I got a rocking hard throbbing cock for the boys in the blue. Stand down and stand by, officer. I'm going to get on my knees and suck your cock until you're dry. Because that's how you show the boys you're really a big hard man with a big ass cock. Yelling, trying to get through the door into the Senate chamber. Suddenly, with no warning, bro, she literally died because of you. Like your your her blood is on your hands, Tucker. It's people like you that have gotten these people whipped up in a fucking frenzy of lies and madness and do your own research mentality from all the way from your show down to the fucking psychotic QAnon radicalization that occurs on Facebook, where a woman, a fourteen year Air Force veteran with a high security clearance, apparently, finds herself flying from fucking San Diego to motherfucking uh, Washington, D.C. to storm the halls of Congress and gets clapped while she's climbing a fucking barricade. If there is anyone who is responsible for this, it's Republican politicians and the Republicans. They're in the main chamber. They're in the chamber. One of them is up on the days yelling Trump won that election. Omega guy reportedly Omega guy reportedly locked himself in Capitol building bathroom so he can masturbate. Cops are trying to de-escalate the situation. Yeah. Breaking, I'm inside Nancy Pelosi's office with thousands of revolutionaries who stormed the building. To put into perspective how quickly staff evacuated, emails are still on the screen alongside federal alert warning members of the current revolution. Bro. Yeah. I have a good analogy for this. This is like when I say, yo, chat, don't raid, uh, don't raid the channel of this guy, right? Don't do it, guys. Oh, he's a fucking cheater. That, that dude, yikes. What an asshole. What a this, what a that. But guys, don't, don't raid his channel, but fuck him. He's cheating and dumbass, right? Like, you know, it's, you know, it's, it's gonna, gonna hard to tell people not to do something and then still mention the the main problem in a, in a negative light, you know? Yeah, well, I do not care about your white feelings. In that circumstance, you can try to remove it from any fucking context you want. But, like, in that circumstance, it's a totally acceptable and reasonable fucking response. Because white lives matter, or all lives matter, or blue lives matter, are reactionary movements created to literally fucking shit on Black Lives Matter. That's precisely why you don't hear white lives matter advocates, which is not even a real thing to begin with. When they don't act out when Daniel Shaver is killed. You know who's actually there? Daniel Shaver, when he's killed in the hands of the fucking police. Okay? You know who's there? Black lives matter protesters are there. White lives matter or all lives matter protests aren't there. Because that's not a real fucking movement. It's just a reactionary fucking uh, uh, made up concept to use against Black Lives Matter to deflect away from a legitimate grievance that black people are pointing out. Uh, uh, lawyer, go ahead, defend it. Your Honor, or if the concern of the police station is that we were defrauding the bounty system, then the concern is this, the entire status of our island. They're concerned that we don't have a commie island that has some hard-ass rules we don't follow. Because when I spawn in this island, I spawn a libertarian! Meant to take the goods I wanted and make the life I want. So if I want to defraud the bounty system, then goddamn it, I'll defraud the bounty system. What kind of bullshit? Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah,
Yeah. And if you set the bounty, you take it. Praise. All right, all right. I am shitting and farting and pissing my pants right now. Like, wow, dude. I'm sorry, but there is nothing fucking dumber than chat literally telling me to build right in this fucking area when I literally told them I should probably build next to people and then they turn around and say single player role playing is like masturbation are you fucking kidding me why are you the way you are but I hope every American pauses for that moment and thanks among themselves. Is that Germa? That we can disagree. I hope that today you will vote with your uh, brains and your hearts and maybe even your genitals, whatever it is. Please let us win. Thank you. Okay, now she's speaking to me. All right, court is now in recess to <laughs> for the jury to deliberate. <laughs> I wish I could bring in that farmer. What's his name? Dafrain or something. I wish I could bring him over. Make him help me build that wall. I do have a vision. I'll tell you what. What? Impossible to mind this. If the White House got Shroud to build their base, they wouldn't get raided like this. Yeah, no, H June, dude. If they, if the White House deployed a Shroud and an H June, they would be clapping these protesters piece by piece, like brat. It's what all happened good. To you? What happened to you? They shot me. That's what happened. I got shot in the face for doing something for doing something for the people. That's what happened. Yo, Hank, what happened, sir? What's going on? Uh, what happened is our inability to role play on the server. That's what happened. It's all good. I tried to return strawberry, but you didn't have your Let's gate see. open. This is like when I say, yo, chat, don't raid, uh, don't raid the channel of this guy, right? Don't do it, guys. He's a fucking cheater. That, that dude, yikes. What an asshole. What a this, what a that. But guys, don't, don't raid his own. But fuck him. He's cheating and dumbass, right? Like, you know, it's, you know, it's, it's gonna, it's gonna hard to, to not do something and then still mention the, the main problem in a, in a negative light, you know? Drama with Hassan. Yeah, but Hassan's not 100k viewers, especially not playing Rust. So, um, I don't know if I want to do that. I want to fight someone that actually matters to the world. Does that make sense? <laughs> little 30k Andy when I'm fucking playing Rust. Okay, suck my dick, egg boy. There you go. He's threatening us with a gun. Look at hey, jury. As we've just seen, two token cat the people fuck? have presented evidence against discrimination. How, then, can we have a case for discrimination? against cats in Lily Peach's museum. Do you know the reason I carry this torch? The reason I carry this torch is it's because it's the same torch that Lady Liberty carries. It's the same torch on the side of justice. Do you know why I carry this rock, Your Honor? No, no, no, Jesus, no! Oh, oh, my God, God damn it. Oh, my God, he's a... But look at, I just, I tweeted out about how, why are people acting like if these were stolen by some dipshit lawnmower salesman from Kentucky that we'd have to redo the election? And I just looked at the fucking photos, because this is where the, the box was being carried or whatever of the electoral college votes. Look who's in the background. That's Andrew, right? It's got, or, is that Andrew or is that like, Nah, Andrew doesn't wear Sperry's though.
I don't think he'd be caught dead in Sperry's. Are those Sperry's? If that's, if those are Sperry's, then that's not Andrew. It does look like him though. Hold on. I'm going to, I'm going to send the photo of this to him and ask him if that's him. Now, as I'm led to believe, you are a cat, sassy kitten chance. Objection, your honor. You are a cat, cat sassy kitten chance. There is no way, by textbook definition, that we could discriminate against cats. I have a bad Objection. On what grounds do you object? Please, please, please. Kelvin Ballsworth, on what grounds do you object? Also in the future, also in the future, please tell me why you're objecting so it's easier so we don't have to do that process. What, what grounds do you object on? Oh. Your Honor, I object. There is nothing in the rule book that says a dog can't play basketball. That's not a legal <laughs> objection. <laughs> objection <laughs> overruled. Objection <laughs> overruled. You may continue, Mr. Big Fat Nuts. Overruled. Did Twitch just remove PogChamp because he's... <gasps> Oh no, because he went all right. Overturning a state certified election. I think that that emote is Yeah, he's been like he's been like radicalized on the internet with, uh, during COVID. This would doom and like literally went from like a COVID denier. I don't know what he tweeted out today, but it doesn't matter though. That fucking face is like transcended the person itself. It's gone way beyond Pog and Pog Champ and Poggers and things of that nature are, are, are, they've taken a life of its own. Uh, it's not, it has nothing to do with the creator, the original creator. It has nothing to do with Gutex. Most people don't even know that uh, the creator himself that spam it. There, boys. Greek, Puerto Rican. You keep saying you're Puerto Rican. Does that mean that you can't be racist because you're saying you're a woman of color? Is that what you mean? Exactly. Well, I, I would disagree that people of color can be racist too. Do you believe that you should? <laughs> Literally, dude. Oh, that's so good. First of all, absolutely people of color can be fucking racist, dumbass. <laughs> Secondly, I'm like, yo, this is great. People actually think it's like a cheat code to be like, well, uh, I'll have you know I'm a person of color. I'll, I'll have you know. I am a person of color after all. <laughs> I bet you did not know this, but <laughs> So what? Is Candace Owens not racist? Like, wh what's going on? <laughs> White people love remember. Plus 200. <laughs> I think. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you fucking snitch. Oh, you guys are going to snitch. There's no way you don't snitch. But this did not happen as an accident. This was expected. So make no mistake. If any Republicans going forward. Act like they're surprised. Act like they're shocked by this. Act like this was not expected. This was not the expected outcome. Shove those words back into their fucking mouths. You reap what you fucking sow. Where is your personal responsibility? You kept crying about Antifa. You kept crying about how violent the BLM protesters are. There's a difference between legitimate grievances and illegitimate ones. You are a sore fucking loser. You're Bro, LSF is big months. mad at you. <laughs> And thanks among themselves. Is that Germa? That we can disagree. Listen, guys. If we are talking about black people being disproportionately uh, uh, killed in the hands of the police, and your answer is like, what about white people? Then a black person saying, I do not care about your white feelings. In that circumstance, you can try to remove it from any fucking context you want. 
But like in that circumstance, it's a totally acceptable and reasonable fucking response. Because white lives matter or all lives matter or blue lives matter are reactionary movements created to literally fucking shit on Black Lives Matter. Shaq. Wait, Will, Will, Will, you're gonna capsize it. Oh. He's him, Lord mercy. Time to push this bad boy back into the sea. Wait, wait, wait, wait for me. All right. Uh, it's all it's all you. Oh, wait, playing. where's the boat? Archbishop, where's the boat? Archbishop, where is the boat? You pushed, you pushed it out with the engine running. Archbishop, where is the boat? Hank, you pushed it out with the engine running, boy. What do you mean? Alexander Botez discovers Hikaru unfollowed her on Twitter. Episode of my happy three months, BB. Speaking of unfollowing, Botez unfollowed me. Did he? Wait, let me look. I will laugh. Drama. Yeah, Botep unfollowed me on on Twitter. I'm trying to explain that I'm a person who wishes to live a very quiet no, life. I take care I not to trouble myself with any no, enemies no, like winning and it. losing that would cause me to lose sleep at night. That is how I deal with society and I. Three month dandy. Oh, he did unfollow me. <laughs> Literally unfollowed me. Literally. I don't know why, but she unfollowed Botez me. Botez drama, Pog3. Yeah, Botez drama, baby. It's drama. What is it? Is it Wednesday? Is it Tuesday? I don't even fucking know. Days have become. It's Tuesday. It's drama Tuesday. Big drama. Big drama. No. What's going on? We don't call 911 in my house. We deal with it like real men by sucking them off until they can no longer walk and no longer feel the need to. Sound Piker watching Check Pickup Porn after his power goes out and he can't stream 2021. Yeah. Hitler was right on one thing. Is he gonna rock it again? Brother, please, no! Oh! Oh! <laughs> this is insane! <laughs> Yo, why don't you, you want, why don't you rock it? It is actually... Have you rocketed it at no, all? No, you don't understand. It's indestructible. It's bugged. Alright, so... I don't think there's a way we can kill it. I think he's gonna die quick. <laughs> this is awesome. This is not awesome. My face is getting shit on. Okay, that's true. We need to die. Hassan, we need to die. Okay. So you I think that was two knives, right? One on one? Yeah. On it looked like a truck. Yeah. All right. Now uh, look straight um, down. I fell off the roof. Now I don't know how to get down. back up. I am. And then <laughs> press one and two. Really oh. fast. Ryan. Oh, I fell off. Ow. Oh, do really, I? Really, yeah. Am I, I dual wielding? One, two, one, I two, one. I broke my legs in here. 
Yeah, yeah. One, two, one, two, one, two. Yeah, that stroke is great. Where are you, Ryan? <laughs> yeah. I guess I'm gonna go outside. Ryan. That's how you do it. Um, I'm, I'm really almost really there. there. I'm almost there, brother. How the heck? Oh, America, oh. brother. Keep thinking about America, brother. <laughs> we'll find it. Right. Oh, jeez. I'm Where is dual the... wielding. Oh. <laughs> What the fuck is this? Georgia woman trampled to death in Capitol riot brought don't tread on me flag the protest? Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Yo. What are you guys doing, dude? Is Hold on. Don't lay it on so fucking thick. There's no way this is real. I do not believe this. Fuck. So if my normie ass friends are watching me play Rust, that means that there's a lot of normies in here. So for those of you who don't know, that's H. June. He's uh, probably one of the best, if not the best, like Rust player uh, on this server or in general. He's really fucking good. Um, and normally this game is brutal. And in, in normal circumstances, game is, yeah, he's funny as fuck too. In normal circumstances, like, he would literally fucking sneeze and murder me, but in and this is a this is a creator made like a uh, creator centric server. But even then, this is the PVP zone, so he has every right to just fucking clap me right there and take the meager uh, little baby fucking loot that I have on me and not think twice about it. But instead, he is really helpful and like you know helps people out. It's awesome. He's great. Ma'am, what, what happened to you? I got maced. You got maced. Hey, my, my place. <laughs> oh. And what happened? You were trying to go inside the yeah, Capitol? Yeah, I, I made it like a foot inside and they pushed me out and they maced me. What's your, what's your name? Where are you from? My name is Elizabeth. I'm from Knoxville, Tennessee. And why did you want to go in? <laughs> we're storming the Capitol. It's a revolution. Wow! Wow! Yes, uh, I'm actually oh, here. Okay. I'm actually here. Uh, sir, uh, no, he, I already he, where he was going. He didn't need it, you know. I already uh, uh, uh, uh, polished mm -hmm. the boots of Officer uh, Cornwood, and uh, I'm here to to show my support for did, law enforcement. Did our tongue? boys in the blue. Is, is that person dead? Well, did you? Use I mean, your you must have polished the right off. Right right right right right right right right right right He's not wearing any boots. Yeah, I did. I sure did. I sure did, folks. He's just um, taking a nap. Okay, good. The boot licking appeared to be something perfunctory. You know, I would, I would, I, you know what? Hold on. Let's, um, you know. Hassan, just, I want uh, you to show what kind of licking we'll, uh, you can do right now. Go over to Officer Cornwood and show what you got. This is what I got. It's a little dark out yeah, now, so I can't no. see, but I do no love. The problem, sir, no, no the problem, deal. sir, is that uh, he doesn't have... Licking. Just be careful. I want to hear you lick. Yep, yep, yep, yep, yep. The quit, problem is hey, that... Hey, quit your uh, yapping and start your licking, boy. They don't, they don't have... Uh, Y'all don't have boots on.